group of artists, writers, poets, we got together and held a discussion because we had received an invitation, not sent to us, but we had seen the invitation, where the Israeli Council to Belize sent to various officials, parliamentarians, diplomats, the who's who in the zoo, as they would say. And that invitation is very disturbing. Why? Two things about that invitation. One, it is asking the persons invited to come to a celebration of the nation state of Israel, the 70th anniversary celebration. We find this as artists disturbing because that same country has been oppressing the Palestinian people of which Belize has relations with. So that's one point. The second point is on that same invitation, they are inviting the officials to the inauguration of a course, a training course called police and community, which means that the Israelis are now going to be training our police department personnel. We don't know the details of that, but we find that very alarming because for one, they're doing it on our own police academy grounds, and for two, which this is the part that's disturbing, we know the record that Israel has with Guatemala. They are strong allies. Actually, Guatemala is only one of two countries on this earth that has decided to move its capital, I mean its embassy to, the, to, to Jerusalem. But that is not the issue. The issue is Guatemala has received decades of training for their armed forces from Israel. Training as well as buying military hardware. And now they are coming at us. To me, this is unacceptable. The artists and the writers in our group find this totally unacceptable. So on the 26th of June, the day when they're having this event in Belmopan, we are calling on our Belizean brothers and sisters to join us because we, will, we have drafted a letter and we will present this letter to the office of the Prime Minister. If he's there, we'd happily present it to him, to the office of the Foreign Minister and to the National Assembly, the clerk, so that he can give each parliamentarian a copy of this letter and then we will proceed over to the Police Academy training area to voice our concern about this matter.